Welcome to this video. We're going to kill this case now. The quick check multiple choice of chapter 25. The chapter is about production and growth. Remember, this is a book of Gregory Mankiw, Principles of Economics. So the first question says, over the past century, real GDP per person in the United States has grown about percent per year, which means it doubles every years so here we have the answers and naturally we don't need to know too much we just need to uh, have like read the uh, naturally the content of that uh, chapter and in the first part you will see this paragraph when it says clearly the United States over the past century average income as measured by real GDP Per person has grown about 2%, so this is between A and B, and income doubles every 35 years. So naturally, the answer is B. 2% per year, and it doubles every 35 years. Second, the world's rich countries, such as Japan and Germany, have income per person that is about times the income per person in the world's poor countries, such as Pakistan and India. So those are the possibility answers of the times that is higher, the GDP um, per person for those countries. And here we have the table, which is going to be natural, the input to answer our question. So I'm going just to have uh, an example of the real GDP of Japan over the real GDP India. So you have here Japan, it is uh, 34,810 over 3,000, let me see here, India 3,330. So it is around 10.45 times higher average income per person for Japanese people compared with the Indian people. The other case, let's take Germany and Pakistan, and then we're going to just have uh, G Germany, which is this one, 38,410 over Pakistan one, which should be 2,760. And we have around 14 times. So it would make kind of an average, it is uh, closer to 12 than the other ones. So naturally, I will pick uh, better the, the question, the answer, C, 12. Well, most economies are, are that natural resources will eventually limit economic growth. As evidence, they know that the prices of most natural resources adjusted for overall inflation have tended to over time. Well, actually, uh, unfortunately, that we know that everybody is concerned about the the quantity of natural resources economically and with data we have seen that the the economies they are not concerned because naturally the economic growth has been higher than the natural resources actually natural resources has been with the time um, cheaper per person due to basically technological advance so then we are more uh, to not concern because I have tended to fall over time natural resources per person the price because capital is subject to diminishing returns higher saving and investment does not lead to higher so income in the long run income in the short run growth in the long run and growth in the short run so here in during the chapter you can see this paragraph that can answer this question because uh, for society to invest more in capital it must must consume less and save more of its current income right so then with this uh, staff that we are going to have that does not lead higher income in the short run because actually this part of the of the income should be saved. Five, when the Japanese car maker Toyota 
expands one of its core factories in the United States, what is the likely impact of this event on the GDP and GNP of the United States? So the GDP rises and GNP falls, GNP rises and GDP falls, GDP shows a larger increase than GD GNP, or GNP shows a larger increase than GDP. So here, uh, remember that GDP it accounts for income by residents and non-residents. The GNP residents of a country home and abroad. So for example, uh, the income, remember, of Chucky Lozano that he's now playing uh, in Italy, this money is going to be naturally for the total income of Italy. However, for the GMP should be this uh, the GMP of Mexico. So then the GDP of U USA naturally it goes up because of the factory and the GMP of USA can uh, can in some way go up. We can we, we, we can say that because residents, some residents that they will work in the factory, they are going to start perceiving income. However, because some of these money is taken back to Japan, naturally uh, the GDP of USA is higher than the GMP of USA. So then the GDP shows a larger increase than the GMP. Thomas Robert Matthews believed that population growth would a. Put stress on the economy's ability to produce food, dooming humans to remain in poverty or spread a capital stock too, th too thinly across the labor force, lowering each worker's productivity, or promote technological progress because there would be more scientists and investors, or eventually decline to sustainable levels as birth control improved and people had smaller families. So. Remember, the idea of Robert Math Mathus is really pessimistic and is really bad about the future of population because basically overpopulation. So then definitely it will we would uh, put a stress on economics ability to produce food, dooming humans to remain in poverty due to the lack of resources. So I hope it has helped and see you naturally next video. Bye bye.